how's it going guys? I'm that Pasu guy! Welcome back to Genshin Impact, episode 4. I know, I know, I just... I'm still wearing the same clothes because I'm still playing this game in one day. <laughs> I can't stop playing, I just finished eating and I'm mad. Uh, I'm like, I want to play some more, I want to explore and shit. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. And then we're going in. I swear, I'm gonna upload like two videos per day. <laughs> when I actually really... What the fuck is this? It's my hair. Jesus. Uh, when I upload this on New Year. <laughs> I hope you... Ah, it's so bright! Ah. This is our experience when we first play the game. It's fucking bright light. <laughs> so you're gonna have to get used to it as well. Du, 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 du. <laughs> ah, oh, okay. It's Amber. It's Amber's ass. Amazing. So last episode we were. What was it? Last episode we did. Uh, what did I do earlier again? <laughs> what did I do? Oh yeah, we did Amber's quest. So let's try to do this actually. Should I do this? You know what? Let's just do this. Uh, okay. Uh, the old guy wants us to do. Uh... Oh, we got adventure rank rewards. Okay, let's go ahead and do claim that shit. Amazing. Do you see the shadow down there? <laughs> it's cute. It's like we're a bird or some shit. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Welcome to the Adventurous Guild. I'm gonna let her finish. For now, because uh, sooner or later we're gonna, she's gonna like, we're gonna start skipping it, her dialogue. Uh, what am I doing again? We go in there. All right, all right, all right. Let's go here. Uh, let's go uh, here. Have you ever seen a physical damage? Uh, what's her name again? Look at all those virus powers. Oh, what? Yeah. Hey. Buddy. Bet you can't keep up with me! Uh, can I climb that? I think I can. If you believe you can, then you can. Just like that fucking story Amber showed us. See that shit? Amazing. Calculated! Killjoy said it first. Let's go back and talk to Cyrus. Cyrus! Cyrus! Where is Cyrus? Okay, there it is. We're gonna give a prototype archive to Razor because for the looks. Huh? <laughs> What's the situation? There are still monsters out and about. Monster monsters in the area, so it seems that the effects of the storm have yet to disperse. Perhaps ah, so there's still time, then time will Razor's guild to show its quality. It's up to us to take those monsters out in the wild on. While the Knights of Favonius are still focused on defending the city around the area. I understand. Thanks for your help investigating. I will consider the commission that we are sending out like this as your reward. Cool. Guide to freedom. We need guide to resistance. We're not doing this because uh, uh, it uh, leads to a... Uh, uh, the fucking dragon spine. So we're gonna go ahead and continue on with our main story. <laughs> Episode four will be about main story. So let's go. Jean. Last time Jean was talking to the to the a bit uh, Fatui, right? And then she's like, ah, "Don't kill the storm terror dragon because he he is the four winds of the nation." And then the Fatui is like, ah, oh, no, you want to kill it so that it doesn't sp spread and shit. But Jane is like, ah, oh, no, you don't know no. So let's not talk about this shit in public. So that's why she's inviting us in our private quarters. Oh, where is she? Oh, here. Hey, Jane, it's me. You want to have sex? It's a crystal embedded with oh, some it's kind of one. power. Lisa, are you able to analyze it? Let me take a look. Hmm. <clears throat> 
I can see impurities in the crystal, but upon further inspection... No, I'm sorry. I can't make a proper analysis at the moment. Give me some time. I'll take a look through the library's restricted section. Right. I'll leave the research to you then, Lisa. Understood. I'll notify you all if I make any progress. Okay. So, I wouldn't go getting your hopes up. They were incredibly ancient texts, not to mention... Ouch! Gosh, that hurt! What? The impurities in the crystal... It hurts when I get close. Oh, I see. It appears to react to visions. So the impurities and the elemental energy we embody repel each other. It's strange, though. You have elemental abilities as well, but don't seem to be affected in the same way. I don't way. have a vision, that's why. Anyway, the crystal would be better left in the hands of my cutie. It will just be a pain if left with us, both literally and metaphorically. Cutie. Fascinating. Do you know anything about what makes you special? I'm a god from another world. I do not know what to make of it either. Well then, the Knights of Favonius have another favor to ask of you. Please accept the title of Honorary Knight. And the gratitude of the acting so grandmaster. Honorary, honorary knight of Favonius? We ask for your continued assistance in finding some answers. <sighs> Storm Terror's rage and strange crystals. <sighs> I know Mondstadt's peace hangs in the balance. May the wind open your eyes to the truth. We'll meet back here if you find anything. Okay. <laughs> Uh huh. Unexpected encounter. Leave the Knights of Bonus headquarters. Alright, well, I'm gonna play for an hour, guys, and then uh, I'm gonna end. This story is the main story, which is very fucking long. So I'm just gonna play for an hour. Maybe 30 minutes, even. Hyman? You wanna talk to me? There's something you didn't tell them. What? The dragon oh, and the, the crystal dragon. weren't the only things we saw. There was that guy. I don't think it's a bad guy. So you do remember him! That green guy! Yeah. He looked just like that guy down there! What? <laughs> that is him! <laughs> what a coincidence. Well, looks like him. What? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. That cliche. <laughs> oh shit, I'm sorry. Wait. Oh, it's this music. Oh, this is where it came from. That green guy disappeared. Use elemental sight to track him down. <laughs> so this is where it uh, it, this music started. <laughs> you guys remember that event with the uh, where you need to hide and shit? <laughs> Transform into objects. Where did it? Oh, there it is. His footprints lead to this wall. Did he climb up from here? Don't know. That's pretty high, though. That is pretty high. Can I climb it? Can I reach it? He did climb up. What a guy. Seventeen. Oh wait. Oh, that's him. Hey. Hello, Mr. Green. Who are these? Oh, he's, he's a bard. That's so cute, Jesus. Adorable. What is to be sung transpired in days of yore, when the Divine Archons still walked the Earth, 
A dragon cast his curious gaze on the world below, as he parted from the heavens that gave his birth. The dragon sought truth amongst common folk, but mortal trifles only fogged his mind. The wind-born bard strummed his strings dolce, and the holy lyre answered his questions kind. The dragon was but a child full of wonder, and soared the heavens free from care. Bard's songs invited him to sing along, for he yearned to let all perceive him fair. Enchanting legends the Bard Damn. and Dragon were, but the tides of despair soon engulfed the land. The Lion Fang perished, and the Falcon Flag slept, as a vile dragon approached Mondstadt in the lone stand. Who's that? Over the cathedral loomed death and his friends. Of the people's agony, the bard soon sang. The soaring dragon heeded his grave calls, and amidst the windstorms, a brutal war sprang. Blood of venom sent the sky dragon into slumber, only to awake to be expelled in abhor. Why do people in this age loathe me so? But the holy liar replied no more. Wrath and woe, vigor and venom, poured from the dragon's bitter eyes. The dragon's curse sprawled in silence, but the liar could no longer soothe his cries. Liar could no longer soothe his cries. Wait, you guys are. Oh, that's right. You're Green the ones fellow. that scared Devalin away. Devalin? Who's that? The dragon? This is told us already. When you're listening, Storm Terror's huh? real name. Oh, right. Most people seem to call him Storm Devalin. Terror. Why do you call him that? Are you two meant to be close or something? <laughs> oh, so close. Hey, so Paimon thinks this guy has a screw loose. <laughs> I'm sorry, you are? I'm Venti the Bard. Venti the Bard. Three-time winner of the most popular bard of Mondstadt, to be precise. <laughs> so, what do you need from me? Given you recognize us, Paimon doesn't believe we need to explain any further. Of course it's about Storm Terror! The dragon. Storm? Hey! Cut it with the amnesia act! Alright, show it to him. The tears. Oh! Isn't this... What? what? The crystal has been purified? When? Last time I checked, it was full of impurities. Tavalin, he... The anguish he feels has brought him to tears. Tears? He was once such a gentle child, now so full of rage and suffering. I also came across a teardrop crystal. Can you purify it? Wow, so magical, so Disney, so amazing. You really do have some wonderful abilities. Someone like you is going to end up getting written into a bard's poem. Okay. Oh, a hero so bright, should she stand in the light. Though stand in the shade, and you'll be met by a blade. Alas, I've really not the time to compose a melody for you at this moment. Anyway, even if Devalin is not taken down, his life will still wither away in the breeze. He'll Devalin. burn himself out in the flames of anger. I feel sorry for Devalin. Is there anything I can do to help? As a knight, as soon as she's turning herself along with the dragon. I really must thank you for purifying the teardrop crystal. It has helped me greatly. What but can it do? I've already come to devise my own plan. Oh? And what plan would that be? Seeing this tear has brought to mind a friend so dear. Friend? Uh. <laughs> One must be going. Hey, where are you running off to? To the symbol of Mondstadt's hero. Bye bye. What? Huh. What do you make of that? This weirdo, as you put it, we need to keep an eye as on him. As far as he's concerned, you're a weirdo too, you know. 
And you too, you know. Know what? You're a weirdo. His voice seems familiar. Old songs here. Oh, why? Familiar? I don't know. You're alone on. What is this? Pure. The pure power of the animal resonates with it. This is the fucking gliding instructions. What is this? When the first wisp of wind oh, brushed okay. <laughs> when cars and wings. Okay. But did he just say symbol of Mondstadt's hero? Oh, Paimon knows it's that huge tree. You what? know, the gigantic one. You can't miss it. Surely you still remember. What are you talking about? Is this? That's Mondstadt symbol? I, I don't get it. The Valen? I mean, uh, Venting? <laughs> I don't remember this shit. Oh? What are you doing here? Though I was just wondering if you would happen to follow me. Want to know more about the animal god? You speak of the god of Animo, Barbados? Barbados. He already disappeared from Mondstadt a long time ago. Liyue and Inazuma's respective gods of Geo and Electro are still present, but Mondstadt has seen many a moon since they last saw their own god. Why do you wish to know about the god of Animo? Does it have something to do with Devalin? Oh, uh, it's because gods. Yes, someone um, told me about Devalin's past. Just how is it that everyone sees Storm Terror? I'm quite curious. That said, there's no need to rush. I have not been back in a while. It seems there are a few who are unhappy with my arrival. We're gonna beat the shit out of this? The wind! I can't open my eyes! Here. What is a creature like that doing out here in such a cool place? Do you think it was going after that green guy? His relationship with the wind seems even deeper than yours. Then, yeah, they seems made the dragon you. wasn't the only thing affected by this change in the wind. Oh, sorry. Now then, you were saying someone had told you about the dragon? Is that so? Quite the scholar, I must say that, Lisa. She's not wrong. The conflict has reached this point only because both sides have resorted to the use of force. His hate, however, did not arise from the people not making tribute to the Four Winds. Nor was it born from his own nature, but instead came about as a product of his degradation. Degradation? The black blood flowing through his heart has been torturing him for years. That's what has allowed him to be led astray by the lies of the Abyss Mage. Abyss Mage. I think I've heard one of them before in Mondstadt. We killed one. Correct. They are from the Abyss Order, an organization comprised of non-human beings. They despise mankind. I don't know where they come from. All I know is that they hold deep hatred toward the human world. Many hilly trolls out in the wild take orders from them and act as their weapons. Before arriving here, I too was like Devalin, cursed and left to waste. But now... Before us stands the symbol of Mondstadt's hero, the Where? place from which Mondstadt rose. Oh, the, tree? the wind amongst the branches is good. I love the way it smells. Being here with you beneath this great tree feels like when the tear was purified earlier. Like the poison is leaving my body. Mm, feels much better. So, how exactly did you get poisoned? Uh... That would be because I tried to communicate with Devalin earlier, but was... interrupted. <laughs> As a result, not only did I not manage to help Devalin break his curse, but instead was also infected myself. Ah, that was my fault. Yes, it was you! So to make up for it, you're coming with me to the cathedral! What are the Mondstadt Cathedral? To do what exactly? To claim a certain holy liar de Hamel. You own the Holy Liar. Means you're Venti, the god of Archon, I think. <laughs> oh wait, I know. I got adventure rank rewards. We meet again, avid adventurer. Are your adventures going smoothly? 
I'm like a well-oiled adventuring machine. That is the spirit. <laughs> it seems that you have a wealth of experience under your belt now. Time to introduce you to the formal work of the guild. Okay. The guild receives requests from far and wide each day, and assigns commissions to adventurers accordingly. These commissioned adventurers are the main source of compensation for our guild members. What kind of commissions are they? It is a mixed bag. Anything from running an errand for fellow citizens to dealing with monsters. Some are textbook, others are extremely dangerous. But you do not have to take my word for it. You should find out for yourself. Here you can find the details of today's commissions. Please report back to me upon completion. Leave it to there me. will be a generous reward waiting for you. Excellent. I knew I could count on you. I await your return with great anticipation. Add, Add Astra, Astra Abyssos. Abyssos. Cool. Yeah, we finally Add got Astra. Astra. We have commissions now. Amazing. Oh, we got free mouse. Let's go to the uh, Venti's plan. I'm going up there. I, I noticed that Catalyst turns into an orb uh, when they, like, uh, you know, attack from above like this. Except uh, it only happens with Catalyst. Like all Catalyst. Like this. See? She turns into. Oh, there's Venti. I didn't see you, my friend. So this Holy Liar de Hamel is... De Hamel. One of the most treasured items in Mondstadt. It's the liar that Barbados used to play. Why are you stealing Wait, it? Perhaps I can help Duval and draw his gentle nature back out of this nightmare he's going through. Will it really stop Storm Terror from causing more damage? Of course. I'm the best bard in the world. There's not a single song I do not know, no matter if it's from the past, present, or future. Look me in the eyes. Do you not find me trustworthy? <laughs> Just what is in your eyes? Look into your eyes. What are you hiding? The color of your eyes is just like the sky in my hometown. Just what is in your so eyes? So how can we get the Holy Liar? It's said that it's enshrined deep within the cathedral. Somewhere safe. I'll go take a look around. You can come if you want. Of course we're coming. Your sis. Another sis. Kaya was sus last time, and now you are, sis. Alright, let's go. Oh shit, I remember. My audio was different from when I record, and then like, it's separated from the game. Oh god. I just remembered it. I'm gonna change it on episode 5. <laughs> Let me handle this. Okay, Venti. Hello there, sister. May the Animo God bless you, young bard. How can I help you? Actually, I know a secret that can save Mondstadt from its current predicament. Oh, what a blessing from the God of Animo. But you should report that to the Knights of Favonius. Why have you come to me? <laughs> because you, dear sister, are able to help. I'd like to borrow the Holy Liar. With it, I'll be able to help Storm Terror. Please see yourselves out. What? <laughs> it's a vicious dragon indeed, but once the acting Grand Master makes up her mind, nothing can stand in the knight's way. That's simply not acceptable. Wouldn't Storm Terror end up getting killed that way? That foolish beast betrayed the winds. Not even the god of Animo themselves would forgive it. <sighs> Please, I beg of you. I'm afraid not, little bard. Strange. Somehow I feel so bad rejecting this sweet child. Then, I guess I'm left with no other choice. You're gonna steal it? I cannot hide anymore. My disciples, rejoice! Behold, the god of Animo, Barbados, has descended. <laughs> Shocked, aren't you? Don't you just want to cry out and rejoice? How does it feel to finally meet the god you've been serving? If there's nothing else, I'll be going back to handle the cathedral's paperwork now. Oh, wait! <laughs> You can't do that like that, Venti, you moron. Huh? She didn't even bat an eyelid. But I have at least learned what I wanted to know. What? She didn't deny that the cathedral is enshrining the Holy Liar. True. Now, since you're the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius, maybe you can give it a shot. We're just gonna steal it. Come on, let's go. Who's she? Hey. Barbados bless you. Mm, I'm I know you. 
You and Amber saved Mondstadt that day. So what brings you here? Tasks from the acting like grand is that so? Yes. Not that I don't trust you. It's just that a suspicious bard came looking to borrow the Holy Lyre as well. He's full of nonsense and even called himself Barbados. He must be up to something. <laughs> there are regulations in place for the use of the Holy Lyre. Currently, it's only used in Ludi Harpastum. Signed documents from the Grand Master, Seneschal, and Community Representative are all required. So, may I see the document from the Knights of Favonius? The Grand Master did mention a forever bringing a permanent aid on our way here. Hey! <laughs> a signed document is required. Without it, there's not much I can do. Damn. Now, if you'll excuse me, I really am quite busy as of late. Okay. You're useless, sister. Well, Venti, we oh, It didn't work. I knew it. <laughs> you knew it? I just wanted to know how influential the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius is. <laughs> you see, the best warrior should always be presented oh, with the best sword. And yet, here we are. Does the story not make for a fitting ballad? So what are you trying to say? That we're not good enough? No, that's not it. More of a commentary regarding Mondstadt's inability to see the warrior standing right before its very eyes. Very well. Looks like borrowing it is not going to be possible. So we're, we're stealing it. We're simply going to have to steal it. Today we stand for free will. Any <laughs> suggestions on just how we steal it? Uh, uh... <laughs> Come now, speak up. That's what free will is for. I don't want to steal anything. <laughs> Look at you, sidetracked from the start. But seriously, you're more suitable for the job than I. I want to have Aside from thing. singing, I don't really have any other talents. Besides, if I was caught, I'd have no one to write the grave injustice of my arrest. <laughs> How can it be a grave injustice if you got caught stealing red-handed? <laughs> but things are different for you. You are the superstar of the Knights of Favonius. You have made contributions to Mondstadt. Uh, if you talk like this, should you, you get should, caught, like, you would easily be able to talk your way out. Or some shit. The guards here. It seems they're off duty throughout the night. If we manage to seize this opportunity, it should be smooth sailing from here. Stop mentioning us getting caught. <laughs> what do you say? Sorry, wait. Did you just say you're Barbarthararos? Ah, uh, yes. Seems I did mention that. Your point being. Uh, you're the god uh, that we can't simply abandon. If, if you're really a god, then we can't simply abandon. Why does your decision hinge upon whether or not I am a god? Because I'm looking for my sister. I'll fill you in on her background story when we get the time. Her? Why is Plyman calling me her? I'm him. His. And if you're not a god, then I'll help the Valen. Huh? Her. I'll bring you the whole larder, Harmel. I don't want to see another separation. Err. Yeah, we know this already. <laughs> Venti, come out. Follow me. Why <laughs> oh, is it bright? It's supposed to be night. Alright. Sneak, sneak. I'm uh, pretty good at this, so uh, I don't need to worry about anything. That guy just literally saw me, but doesn't care. See? Told you I'm good. Easy. Easy shit. Huh? Oh Who no! Are you? She's so hot. She disappeared! Freeze! What are you doing oh, here? No, uh, nothing. I was just uh trying to catch a thief. If it that's how it oh, looks no. like. Oh We're busted! Run! We're what? busted. <laughs> Follow me. Oh, 
Oh god. <laughs> We're busted. <laughs> I'm gonna know somewhere. Safe house. Uh, Master D. Luke, <laughs> this is this week's accounts. <sighs> the disaster has greatly affected business. Well, let's hope it all ends soon. Hi! We'd like a seat at your, uh, least conspicuous table. Um, the second floor has fewer customers. You'd be less conspicuous up there. <laughs> but aren't you a bard? Why not sit front and center? <laughs> Let's save the paid performance for next time. We'll be heading up now. See you in a bit. Sissy. Hey, keep an eye on them. There's something strange about that bard. I'll go ask around. Ask who exactly? Around. The protectors of Mondstadt. <laughs> okay. The protectors of Mondstadt. Uh, Master D, look! Have you seen two thieves around? What? what happened? Why have you mobilized so many guards? <laughs> Haven't you heard, Master D, look? Two thieves are trying to steal the Holy Liar! Oh? Huh? How odd. Isn't it? The Holy Liar is a treasure that was played by the god of animal themselves! Such a precious piece of cultural heritage! Uh... Why would one want to steal something they can't sell off? Would pay better to steal from my sellers. Huh? Sorry, off topic. Believe they headed that way. Understood. Thank you, Master D. Luke. <laughs> okay. You saved us. Today, I think I'll have a glass of. You can put down that bottle you stole from behind the counter. Something cold. Right. I want answers. Let me finish my drink first? I'll pay you. Well, with a performance. It's not about money. You seem too young to be drinking. No need to worry. When I started drinking, you were still... Actually, yeah. He is Master Diluc, the boss of... the... the owner of this tavern. He's very famous. By the way, his dandelion wine is one of my favorites. Although, most of the time, I can only afford a bottle or two. <laughs> I just heard about some thieves from the guards. For the record, I like your guts for trying to steal the Holy Lyre de Hamel. Even if you are fools. But we don't often get to see people like you. It wasn't us that stole it. The real thief is still out there. This is the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius. Why would someone so aspiring steal Mondstadt's sacred treasure? Hotshot? Oh, so it's you. So, you and the bard are close friends? We're not close, I th I've only heard him play once. Well, despite only being a passing traveler, you still offered your help to Mondstadt in its time of need. A shame you joined the Knights. The Knights of Favonius. <laughs> Inefficient right from beginning to end. And towards the Fatui? Weak and conservative. Forget it. I don't feel like talking about it. <laughs> Seems you don't really like the Knights of Favonius. Just differences in approach is all. I have my own hopes for this city. Now, answers. Why did you steal the Holy Liar? You sure you want to know? It could implicate you in the affairs of the Knights of Favonius. That's fine. I somehow always end up implicated in their affairs. If I tell you the story with a performance, Will you believe me? It depends. I'll make my own judgment. Then will I get paid? Your reward will range from anywhere between five Mora and the Holy Liar. It all depends on your story. Very well. Let me put on a show. Another story? Hell yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. We already heard about it. What did I just witness? This is confidential information. 
Why did you let me know? Why? Hmm, perhaps the winds are changing. What say you, Master D. Luke? Interesting. Give me some time. I'll organize some contacts. Outlander, as one of the knights, it seems you're not a suspect. Blonde is the only description on the wanted poster. You should be safe. Blonde. As for the bard, however, it'd be better if you stayed in the tavern. <laughs> no problem. I like taverns. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's meet here tonight after the tavern closes. Okay, leave the tavern and come back. You look. You're beautiful. You're a beautiful specimen. Choo -choo -choo. Leave the tavern and then go back to the tavern. I don't know. You're here. Of course I'm here. I just. Wait, you're. Uh, Jean? Wow. First of all, I contacted more than one person. Secondly, she came here as Jean herself, not as the acting Grandmaster. A Jean you would never see, even as an honorary knight. What a surprise. I heard about the Holy Liar, but I never suspected it was you. So, the sound of the Holy Liar can purify Storm Terror and return it to normal? Is that true? That's right! Your honorary knight is putting themselves on the front line to try and resolve this Storm Terror issue. Now that's the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius I'm talking about. Feels like we're breaking the law, though. I understand this kind of absurd explanation is hard to believe. But we can ask the Bard to play the song again to try and persuade... Persuade. I believe you. To persuade our stubborn command... Wait, what? I can't think of any reason for Devalin's betrayal, given it was once one of the Four Winds. However, really if it was funny. poisoned in the battle over Mondstadt all those years ago, and then corrupted by the Abyss Mage after it woke up, we can't really blame it. But as Acting Grandmaster, I obviously cannot make such a statement publicly. Diplomatic pressure from the Fatui makes it hard for us to seek a peaceful resolution to the Storm Terror issue. People would think I've lost grip on the gravity of the situation. That's why I can only do this in private. <laughs> That's one of the reasons I don't like the Knights of Favonius. So much paperwork. What surprises me is that you would believe an Outlander so easily. My cautious and meticulous superior. Even you trust him, don't you, sir? <sighs> I already told you not to call me sir. Never mind. We don't often get to work together after all. Sir? Uh... <clears throat> Awkward. Wow, um, this is really awkward. <laughs> I have a rough idea of where the Holy Liar de Hamel is. Oh, shit. Nice recovery. She's really talented at changing the subject. <laughs> the conflict between Mondstadt and Shneznaya stems from the conflict between the Seven Nations and their respective gods. Shneznaya's the Cryo Gods Fatui seem to be after the Animo God's power. Uh... So are they going to take over the defense of Monsta? They want to kill the Valen. Right. If the Knights of Favonius publicly prevented an attempt on Duvalin's head, then the only other way to affect the Animo God's power is to take the Holy Liar. The number of Fatui that have come to Mondstadt is far from limited. I've already managed to coerce a few reports out of them. Diluc has determined that the Holy Liar is not being held in the Goth Grand Hotel. I imagine they don't want to leave something stolen in a place where it could be so easily found. Paimon gets it! If too much of a scene gets made, then it becomes a big diplomatic issue. <laughs> Such is the diplomacy between the Seven Nations. Outlander, ready to go? Yeah. Right. Uh... Jean just said the Fatui are trying to take Devalin's power for the Cryo God. I fear this might fall short of their true intentions. Cryo God, huh? I think they intend to use Barbados's connection to the wind to draw him out. Just like Lisa traced the source of the storm to the temples. The God of Animal? Hasn't been seen for more than a thousand years. What makes you think that's their intention? Oh. Uh, <laughs> uh, <huh? laughs> 
forget it. I don't like having to pry. Here, take this. What is it? A disguise to protect your identity. Put it on before you run into the Fatui. Okay. What is it? Put it on? Put it on? Put it on? Unfortunately, there's still one of Mondstadt's allies. At least that's the facade we're maintaining. Our actions are going to get them stirred up. Better to not implicate yourself on a personal level. We're gonna find acorns. Okay, we go, we're going there. We're going to finish this dungeon and then I'm gonna end this uh, episode. Yeah. Let's catch some fish. Whee! Can't run away from me, fish. Run away. Wow, you're such a genius. But fish can't run away. I know. We have to look. Damn, he looks fucking cool with his mask. Either has it too. <laughs> Imagine if the look has an outfit, bro. Damn. Hey. No, no, no! Don't eat me! You're, you're human? Yeah, I'm one of you. The entire here. floor's defenses have been broken. I thought it was the Abyss Order attacking. How did you guys know the liars here? The place is being kept is locked up tight. If you're after the key, keep going further into the ruins, but don't come after me. Okay. I don't know which one of the guards has it, but I'm sure you can find the guards and find out for yourselves. Okay. This guy looks like he's about to wet himself. <laughs> you, you just worry about yourselves. One of the eleven is already in Mondstadt. Signora, when she gets her hands on you, she's gonna string you up and torture you. When that time comes. Don't you dare say a word about me. Okay. Senora, huh? Did he say Senora? What a strange name. Senora. Number eight of the eleven goes by the name Senora. The fact that the team can run amok across the seven nations like they do is entirely because of the eleven. We need to act quickly before she gets wind of what's going on. Yo. Who are you? How'd you get in here? Uh, there's nothing to discuss. Give up now. We are goodwill ambassadors from the Snish... Snish... Normans... Cadian and... Sis. Never heard of that association before. <laughs> what are you lot doing here? Wish to borrow her. We are here to do goodwill stuff. We are investigating you for alleged corruption. That lies way too obvious. You really haven't got anything better. I and don't. just how do you plan to borrow it? By taking it away from you. How does 500,000 Morris <laughs> have an apple? <laughs> we'll recommend you to the association. Have an apple? <laughs> Wait, what? You're convinced? <laughs> <laughs> Think you can look down your nose at me? Oh, huh? I thought you're convinced. The will of Shneznaya is as solid as the permafrost. I will not yield. For an apple? Are you serious? Oh, it's the bitch that stole the... Here to play with me? Yes, baby, I am. There you are, eavesdropper. Hello, baby. Oh, go, I'm go, so Baron bad. Bunny! Am I using gold gravestone? I think I am. Oh, I am, bro. Holy shit. I'm using the gold gravestone. On the look. Damn, it's a broken sword. Oh god, it's so cool. I wish I get this weapon. There's a chest here. Obviously a trap. <laughs> Seems like we turned this room inside out. No key. We're going up. Time to move on to another room. I have the look, guys. There's Amazing. And this is a weapon. Surely the key must be in there. Okay. Who are you? What are you doing here? Shut up, you pussy. <laughs> Grrr! Give up now! Enough talks! Stick him up! Uh, you're just going to attack me? Yes. Uh, I am a proud citizen of Snezhnaya. I will not falter. <laughs> you are already faltering. This is what you got, bro. 
Did I take damage from that shit? Oh god. Disappear! Wind blade! No escape! Time for retribution! Give that give that wolf gravestone to Razor. Oh god, okay. Might as well use the loot. It looks cool here. Look at him. Jesus. Huh? This is the guy that we were aiming and his sword, you know, like the first get The first time time the game came out and like he created like 50 accounts just to get this guy. <laughs> Where did you rats scurry out from? Uh, Senora's not going to tolerate this kind of interference in our affairs. Uh, okay. So I'll be the one to take care of you. Her the trouble of having to deal with you herself. Not so good now, are you? There you go. Oh, you're still alive. <laughs> So life, watch Amber kill you. You can't <laughs> run from dead. You can't run from death. The holy liar. Stop the payment. Finally, the liar is back in safe hands. Amazing. Where did that guy go though? He was here a second ago. Senora is going to end you. The songs Bard sing of your demise will be so terrifying. The people of Mondstadt will never sleep again for the nightmares they give them. Okay. Big talk for a guy who still ran off in the end. Chicken. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, we did that, guys. Amazing. We're gonna end that there because it's almost an hour. It's a, it is an hour. We don't have any more. Uh, what? Really? No chest? No boobies? Well, that's disappointing. <laughs> oh, shot. Okay, I'm gonna end that episode there, guys. I hope you enjoyed uh, episode four. Uh, I'm gonna call this one uh, the look impact. <laughs> the look is Batman confirmed or the look impact? Yeah, let's just let's just stick with the look impact. And uh, leave a like, subscribe if you love one more. Or keep me. I'm gonna keep playing because uh, yeah, my friends enjoy, enjoys these videos. <laughs> so yeah. Leave a like, subscribe if you haven't. Be, be sure to do. You, 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 I don't think you lose anything from doing that shit. Yes? See this adorable bunny? That's why you should subscribe. See this beautiful razor? Subscribe to have some more dancing bunny. And I'll see you guys in the next episode of Genshin Simpack. The looks Simpack, rather. <laughs> so yeah, goodbye. I don't have an outro, but this is going to be my outro. I'm still here.